I know it's not entirely Christmas, but we are in line right now to meet the ugly stepsisters at the base of the castle. <laughs> I don't know what that magic ear contraption is. Why don't you come right in the middle? You're oh great. no, okay. <laughs> there we go. You can come in. Your hat's adorable. Hello, so how do you know each other? This is my, my beloved wife. Ooh, is there jewelry nice. involved? <gasps> oh, yeah. Ooh. oh, I want fancy jewelry. Well jewelry. done. Oh, oh my that. goodness, it keeps looking at me. Is that a good oh, thing? It is a good thing. It looks like I'm stuck in the magic mirror. <laughs> but at least I look beautiful. Tell everyone how eligible I am. How eligible you are? I'm the most eligible. You're the most eligible. And and what about yourself? Well, I think I'm going to get married well before my sister. Don't you? <laughs> it could happen. Had to happen. find the right prince That's to marry. Drusilla. This is Anastasia. Ah. Obviously. Can I compliment that your hat's adorable. Fedorable. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Can we say Merry Christmas? Sure. Merry Christmas. Thank you. You too. <laughs> Merry Christmas. To you as well. Thank you very much. You're welcome. <laughs> It was earlier for you, so I'm just taking my spot. Wherever I come, I've had luck. Just come my way. Wherever I go, hard luck is dead and stay. Good luck never stays a day. A bad luck's always a come in my way. Christmas is officially over, but there are a few traces of Christmas here at the Magic Kingdom. And what do I mean by that? I'm talking the Christmas party. Sadly, we didn't make it to the Christmas party for a couple different reasons. One, it is rather expensive, but mainly we're a Halloween family, not so much Christmas. So we decided to opt out on that, which is okay. Because once the Christmas party ends, you can still experience a lot of what they offer at the Christmas party during regular park hours and that is what we're here to check out today and first up let's take a look at the christmas party And during the holidays, the Jungle Cruise turns into the Jingle Cruise, but it is not specific only to the party. You could take the Jingle Cruise all season long, and we're going to do it now because we have a Fast Pass. It's Christmas decorations, Christmas presents in the queue line. And of course, there's the Jungle Cruise, the Jingle Cruise Christmas tree, saying, Santa, please stop here. Is that for Ted? I wonder who Ted is. They do have Christmas decorations throughout the dock. Right now we are in the fast pass lane. The regular standby lane is over there. They probably have more, but we're fast pass riders. Even the tarantula has a Santa hat on, which means he's in the festive mood. He's all excited. Or does he want to get one of the people in line here? They have a sign here that says, here we go, Awa Sailing and a container for ethanol eggnog. Remember, keep refrigerated. All the boats have been renamed for the Christmas season. This one here is Vixen Val. I wonder who we're going to get. Looks like our boat is so aptly named Eggnog Annie. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle all the way. What fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. 
Now right behind me, we should have a Pygmy Beach holiday party, and here it is. And here it is because uh, there's nobody there. That's awkward. Now a lot of people are throwing out my decision to hire gorillas, but as you can see, well, the turnover is just fantastic. I'm sure you've all heard of the North Pole, right? Well, this must be the quick before we get trampled by full-grown African rhino. Better climb up that pole. We're not entering head on a territory. We're just some dog favorite holiday characters like um, Dancer. Wow. You were Dancer. Thank you. And once you look at that, we even have our very own little drummer boy right there. Right up here we have Trader Santa. And he is the jungle's head salesman, so this year he's offering you a Yotai special. Two of his heads, 40 years. Now, I really think you should think about it because anyway you slice her and dice it, well, you're going to come out ahead on the deal. And as you exit the jungle cruise, it's like you're entering a new year. Happy New Year. It even has some of the skipper's New Year's resolutions. And now we're heading out to Tomorrowland to see some very special characters and a dance party that they have going on. Merry Christmas! We're not a big fan of the dance parties and more specifically, Tomorrowland is probably our least favorite land here, but we do enjoy it nonetheless. And plus, you can also meet some very rare characters here in the dance parties. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna make myself dizzy. Oh, one more time. Okay. Uh... But during the Christmas parties, there was a totally Tomorrowland Christmas, which is a dance party with some of the Disney Pixar characters. Uh, totally Tomorrowland. Flies around the world in a... 
Yeah. Does slow power the wild rocket? No. Does slow power the wild gas? Mm-mm. Ew, Stitch! The sleigh is pulled by a tiny reindeer. Oh. Reindeer, who is it your catch? Who rides back? Um, easy to catch? Whatever. Well, I hope he finds Santa in time for the big finale. <gasps> Maybe he'll even make it snow. In the meantime, let's welcome our first special guest star, direct from Star Command Headquarters, right here in Tomorrowland, Buzz Lightyear. Go for it, Space Ranger. It all happened on a night very much like tonight. A fateful encounter with my sworn enemy. Night when hearts were warm and spirits were bright. And the sound of sleigh bells filled the air. Missile Ball, Stardate 975.1. A day or two ago, I thought I'd take a ride. And soon some friends of mine were seated by my side. Our ship was fierce and fast. But then to our surprise, the engines took a laser blast. It looked like our demise. But who would do such a dastardly deed? The evil Emperor Sir! And it's five minutes. In a turbo rocket sleigh, the peril we would face, Sir, laughing all the way. We zoom from place to place, keeping him in sight. What fun it is to find and chase and capture Sir tonight! Tiny town, put all the bells and lights, and brought his fury down. And then, without a reason, Sir lowered his defense. The spirit of the season had brought him to his sense. Merry Christmas, Buzz Lightyear, and Sir, Merry Christmas to you too. And to all of you, peace on earth and goodwill to men this holiday season. Stitch the slope. Reindeer, too fast. Sigh. This is gonna be harder than I thought. Oh, I know. You gotta head to the North Pole. That's where his workshop is. He builds sleds there? No, he builds toys. With the elves. To give to the kids. You know, making a list, checking it twice, gonna find out who's really nice. <gasps> who's been nice out there? Let me see those oh. hands. Yeah. And then he slides down the chimney and delivers toys to all of these nice kids. Santa's fallen kids and break into her house? Well, not exactly. 
Really? Santa make must? Uh, yeah. Santa wrap up kids with high badness level? Well, I wouldn't put it that way. Santa sound like big snitch to stitch. Stitch? Why would you say that? Sometimes stitch have high badness level. Hmm, does stitch not get any toys? Well, I'm sure Santa will bring you a little something. Don't tell me, Stitch understand. <laughs> stitch take care of Santa. <laughs> no, 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 He's gonna go find Santa! Go Stitch! <laughs> okay, people, it's time to welcome our next guest star, and you all know him by name! When he sneezes, you think it's glitter, but it's snot! <laughs> I used to love playing games. You want to know my favorite? I spy! Oh, come on! These are the jokes, folks! Speaking of Santa, how about those elves? Two elves walk into a candy shop to buy some sugar plums. One elf says to the other elf, Hey, can you lend me a couple of bucks? I'm a little short. Short. You know, Santa's watching you not laugh right now. Okay, folks. to track Santa, so Stitch hunt him down. I told you to track down Santa and bring him here for the big finale, not blast him into smithereens. Oh, but Santa big snitch or broke into her house. Why do you want him there? Well, Santa's not a snitch, Stitch. He's a great friend to all of these good girls and boys, to kids of all ages. 
changes. He comes around just once a year and brings the spirit of the season with him. A wonderful season filled with joy and happiness, memories and traditions, friends and family. Family? Oh, Hannah, no family. So Christmas about Oh, Hannah. It's the great stitch and just in time. So, where's Santa? Can you still see him? Uh, Santa is still. What? Uh, stitch me to fly around. Uh. Oh, Stitch, we really needed him for the big finale. And I was hoping he was going to make it snow. Oh, don't worry, honey. Stitch fox, Stitch fox. No, no, Stitch, wait. <laughs> Santa Claus is coming to town. I hope. say that was a lot better than what I thought it was going to be. It was so disgustingly cute I want to die! <laughs> the, the characters, especially Stitch coming out as Santa Claus, was probably the best part. One thing that I really missed about the Halloween party that I regret not seeing was Stitch, Rock and Roll Stitch, the Elvis Presley Stitch, yeah. so it was kind of cool to see him dressed like this. Well, we got rained out every night we came, so we unfortunately missed a lot. Well worth it. I'm so glad we watched the whole thing. Our original plan was just to catch a little bit to show you guys what it was, but I didn't want it to end. A lot of fun. It was so cute. So cute. Would you look at that? There is Christmas decorations here as well, and we are in line to meet Gaston from Beauty and the Beast. Apples, 
Bonjour, my friends. Bonjour. It's so good to see you. Right this way. <laughs> So tell me, when did you realize that you belonged by my side? Would you say it's back when you heard the stories about me? Or now you see oh, they're stories. All oh, there's plenty of stories about me, my friend. There are. I actually heard all a rumor. Of them true. Oh, and what's that? You killed Bambi's mom. Wow. You know, I can't keep track of all the trophies on my wall. That just seems unreasonable to me. You have me. a lot of small trophies on your wall. All the small animals. Well, I keep the best ones back at my own village. <laughs> and in my own home where I can admire them myself. These ones are just for public consumption. <laughs> so tell me, what brings you to my side today? Well, typically we're a Halloween couple. We love Halloween, but it's Christmas now, so we wanted to stop by and say Merry Christmas. Well, I would say you have chosen the best way to observe the holiday. It's by visiting a large man in red who brings joy to everyone else with his mere presence. You are in the right place. Can you say ho ho ho? I could, but I think I'd rather show off these ones. There you go. <laughs> My friends, it has been a pleasure. Mostly Thank for you. Thank you, sir. We don't have reservations for tonight, but the Be Our Guest restaurant in the Beast's Castle is right there. Great place to eat. So this isn't very Christmassy at all, but sometimes this view just is stunning to me, especially when the sun's going down and everything's silhouetted. From Fantasyland, Peter Pan's ride is over there. Prince Charming Carousel, the castle in the background. Doesn't get any better than this. We've never attended a Christmas party before, but last year around this time, usually we come to Disney around the Christmas time, so things kind of mix what is party exclusive and what isn't. Like for instance, right now we're getting ready to watch Elsa light the castle. Well, not light the castle, but kind of freeze it. Freezes the castle. Freezes the castle. Pretty yeah. much. So everybody's waiting, there's people everywhere, and I don't know exactly when, I'll have to check the time. What are we looking at? About 25 more minutes of waiting. We scoped out this spot, which is right here in the front, probably about an hour ago. So to give you an idea of what we're working with here, we are at the base of the castle, straight ahead, right in dead center of the screen, you can see Main Street. That tall green spire is the Christmas tree, and there's just people everywhere waiting for the show to begin. It's crazy. This is the day after Christmas. And I really believe that we actually have the best seat in the house for the first time. There's the front, a couple people ahead of us, just a little far back, a few people back. It's like three rows, if you were to put it like that. Down here. 
here and meet our new friends. Oh, can I? I would love that. Right there. I'm okay. I'm okay. Oh, boy. Hope that doesn't even matter. Oh, Olaf. Hi, Olaf. Olaf, this is um everyone. Everyone, this is Olaf. Hi, hey, everyone. Whoa. Whoa. They got so much bigger. Are they? They're staring. Why are they staring? Are they real? I think so. Oh, of course they're real. That's early. Oh. Hi, I'm Ola, and I like warm hugs. You know, for a snowman, you sure do like warm things. Yup, like oh. summer. Oh, I've always loved the idea of summer and sun <laughs> and summer fun. It's winter. Winter's good, too. Yes, and this kingdom is dressed so beautifully for the holidays. It really is. I love the trees wrapped in lights. Oh. And the bows and ribbons are perfect. What's that amazing smell? Chocolate! Chocolate. <laughs> I sure do love your kingdom! It's the perfect place to spend a winter holiday. Perfect, except there's no snow or ice. <gasps> then it would really feel like winter. Kristoff's right! Like holidays in Arendelle! You could go sledding, or have a snowball fight, or go ice skating! Oh. And you could build a snowman. <gasps> Who likes warm hugs? Yes! Someone who can do that. Yeah, who? Uh, and she's already here? Yeah, who? She, she made, made you. you! Oh, don't be silly. Elsa made you. Uh, oh, Olaf. <laughs> Elsa, wouldn't oh. it be great if you used your frozen for actually powers to cover the castle in ice and snow? Oh, no, I would love to. But I can't. This isn't our home. We're visiting and we have to be respectful to those who live here. It could be like a holiday wish. And I bet they'd like it. Oh, I don't know. Well, wouldn't you all like to see Elsa cover the castle and I can smell? Oh. Ah, see? They want you to do it! The people want ice! Oh, no. Ice and snow! Olaf! Come on, everyone! Ice and snow! Ice and snow! everyone's help. Will you help me? Yeah! This is gonna be so much fun. Okay, everyone. Envision this castle wrapped in shimmering ice, the snow cascading down its tall towers, twinkling like a million stars. Now, feel that icy magic swell and swirl within you. Do you feel it? Are you ready? Now, let
It does feel more like a winter holiday now. What better way to spend the holiday than with family? And friends. <laughs> and new friends. Thank you all so much for having us here and for making our holiday wonderful. <laughs> Happy holidays, everyone! Goodbye! See ya! Bye-bye! <laughs> Happy holidays! More hugs for everyone! Oh! Oh, uh-oh. Hey, guys? Guys? Oh, wait for me!
me something silly. Tell you I promise I won't tell. A face that fashion is quite as sweet. I mean, what do I do? Just the sweet. Snap on Snapchat doesn't last. And voice now that's from Christmas past. Woo! It's Donald. He must have gotten my text. Hello? It's been a long time to be missing you.